It says we're live. We are live. It's giving we're live. It's giving we're live. It's giving, it's giving we're live. It's I'm, giving Jello has to share the game with us. I'm so oh. stream pilled, I forgot to. <laughs> Shut up. I hate you so much. Uh, I will genuinely say I've seen the, the rest of the game. It, it actually gets extremely intense. Um... I don't know what to give content warnings for. I just know that it's gonna be a lot. <laughs> See, friend. You tilt your head. <laughs> Sorry, I just wanted to say your name. Mira. See, friend. Mira. <laughs> See. No. See <laughs> is my sea friend nickname, Mira. You have to pick another one. I'm sorry. I won't budge on that. Gems alive, Isabo. I, uh, I mean... What? But, but you and Seafrin share Mira. It's not fair. That's true. All right, in the spirit of fairness, we can get joint custody of Seaf then. You know, I think I'll pick another name for Seafrin after all. <laughs> but Isabo picked Seaf and Bonnie picked Frin. I, I have no letters left. <laughs> hey, Savvy, do you have anything to report? <laughs> okay, uh, I was gonna wait for like when, I, when we did the bit naturally again or something. But yes, you'll be pleased to know, chat, that Odile with the Jordans is complete and available to be looked at. Go look at it. <laughs>work but here we go no no <laughs> no don't open the don't open the twitter don't open the twitter hank <laughs> hank like i said i was prepared for it and we still have a king's butt to kick so we can't save everyone oh nope <laughs> so we can't save everyone <laughs> can we i mean some people just gotta die but i would do anything to protect all of you horrible things to be honest as long as i could be sure you were all safe I need to let you all know, I've been in a time loop for some time now. <laughs> <laughs> and the worst part is it happens whenever, like, I'm beyond my control, it just restarts. I <laughs> have found no pattern whatsoever. <laughs> Though some, it does happen when Seafren's about to touch those weird bobs, blobs of water. As you eat, you look at everyone. They're smiling. Freaks. Happy. <laughs> Fucking freaks. Sometimes one of them sees you looking at them and smiles at you. In this moment, you are loved. Bitch over there getting loved. Can I point friend. <laughs> would you perhaps- I literally read that as, Would you perhaps accept a crumb? I'll give you one last chance though. Would you like to sit down and have a talkie talk about what just happened? No. Nope. Okay, no problem. But when we're done and we've won, and we eat dinner tonight, having beaten the king. Before we go our separate ways, we will have the feelings talky talk. Huh, you snort. A sure thing, Isa. Oh, you said sure. We are going to have this talk. Caught you. You're stuck now. You will be emotionally vulnerable. <laughs> but don't you have another talk with Isabeau planned? Only if we can have <laughs> that first talk first. That first talk? What? Isabo freezes in the middle of his sentence. <laughs> yes! That other talk! The one I said I would have with you last night in the clock tower after we went back. Yes. That talk, yes. <clears throat> uh-huh. Two talks, see? <laughs> one talk each. Uh, we can get through this. Isabo gives you a shaky thumbs up. Smirking, you give one back. I'm fucked! You two are so Sorry. stupid. But that scent around you, could it be? Yeah, man, I just had Malanga fritters. They were fucking delicious. Malanga <laughs> yeah, bro, fritters a perfect food. <laughs> Can I have some? Yeah, right, you want one? <laughs> Get on, freeze time. <laughs> Oh, really? What the fritter? <laughs> Unfreezes time, immediately glocks him in the head. <laughs> it does 
not matter. <laughs> he can smell Loop's dogs. <laughs> <laughs> I need to learn time craft. Oh, well, that's simple. Well, it's just this one hand gesture. You just put one of your index fingers straight up in the air, and then your thumb perpendicular out to the side. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> Loser! <laughs> An L on your forehead. Well, <laughs> that's no good. I don't think I had the shield up. Yeah. Whoa, uh oh! My, my bad. Uh oh! That went great! I would love it if, like, you loop back in, but for all of them that are sitting there eating and Seifert just goes, fuck, god damn it. It's like, what, did, did, like, did something like, happen? No, it's all fine. No, okay, it's all but... fucking fine. <sighs> Great, now you guys are all like, worried and shit, whatever, jumps in the fire. Oh my god, Seifert just restarts. Oh, the I should have used the time tier. It would have been much faster. Oh, why did I do this? Oh, Stardust, by the way, you're out of loops. What? <laughs> Mirabelle, brush my hair real fast. <laughs> Stardust, by the way, you're immune to fire. Uh, a friendly reminder for people that might have popped in late. Uh, Savvy did complete the uh, <laughs> Odile in Jordans. It is not safe for work. I cannot stress this enough. I haven't seen the person who was looking at it at work in a while. Hope the job's okay. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I hope your job's cool, dude. Dev says, I'm here in Jello's chat to make sure everyone is having a nice, wholesome time. Savvy immediately draws Odile in Jordans. Hey. <laughs> we're, like, we're just changing up the costume a lot. Hey. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Added his skin, Dev. I drew that with nothing but wholesome thoughts in my heart, okay? Oh, I thought you were leaving that. I, I drew that with nothing, and I'm like, that is correct, besides the <laughs> shoes. <laughs> I drew that, and you all have to deal with it. <laughs> that Ain't is that a just huge problem. It. I re really love YouTube poops, specifically sentence mixing ones, and also mixed sensing ones, and also one sentence mix. No sense, the Lord's legit one of my favorite things. I do not enjoy the pyramid. Oh God. Oh God. Oh, he went and got. He went and got something. He went and got a cold one. I no, a I cold needed one. A, I, the cold one was secondary. I needed a um. I needed a towel. Mm. I got so scared of the king I peed a <laughs> I have always thought change was about changing yourself and only yourself if I couldn't be how I thought I had to be clearly the fault was mine you know it's my responsibility to change even if I don't want to that's what I thought at least but if even you Seifrin can understand what I'm going through if you're the same even in a small way but I must believe that I'm not the only one feeling this way about the change belief either. And if I'm not the only one feeling restricted by the change belief, if there's more people out there feeling the same as I do, then shouldn't the belief change instead of us? Hey, what'd you mean by even me? I'm gonna start a schism, see, friend. <laughs> Blood will be spilt. <laughs> <clears throat> All right, you big bitch, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine if he straight up wasn't here, you big bitch. You breathe, you breathe, you breathe. Power of friendship, huh? Why would whatever happened before change anything now? Because you're loved now. You were safe. Is that what you thought? Stupid, stupid, stupid. You try and breathe. Oh, Seyfried. It's fine. It's just the end again. It's the same. See? You already know what will happen after that. If you know what happens next, it means you're fine. You're fine. You're fine. Seafren. Hey, what's up? Something wrong? You turn your head. Odile is looking right at you. <laughs> Great face. You can't shift your expression fast enough. Seifrin? What is it? Is everything okay? 
Head house maiden, is something the matter? I can't fix it on my own, not before it all ends. If only I'd noticed sooner. Huh? What's happening? Frin? You can't move. You're frozen. Seafrin, what's... Seafrin, what's... <laughs> is something happening? The air around us, it feels like... Ugh. My head hurts. It's my fault that you have to suffer like this. Seafrin! They're all running, reaching towards you. Frin, come back! Something's wrong! You have to move. Seafrin! Just move. I just hope that one day... You can catch Isabeau's hand. Save! Save! Seafrin! You might learn. You take a step forward. To forgive. And then... Press your palms against your eyes and laugh. You really believed it, stupid. You really thought this was it. You really thought helping them would save you. If you helped them, if you were loved, it had to save you, didn't it? Friendship would save you, wouldn't it? <laughs> it was different, oh, but not enough to save you. And now, Mirabelle is back to feeling awful and out of place. Isabeau won't remember the night you spent under the stars. Odile is still hiding everything about herself. Bon Bon is back to Bonnie, is back to hating you. And you're back here. That's what you get for hoping. That's what you deserve. <laughs> oh, Mirabelle will be here soon, won't she? Welcome back, Stardust. Bummer vibes. Oh, I just remembered, uh, apropos of, like, literally nothing. Um, I want to go get some, uh, some fucking double cream and mascarpone cheese at some point, because I'm going to make myself a homemade tiramisu, baby. Ooh, mascarpone. Oh, mm. that's not how I heard that. What did you hear? I thought, I, I was trying to process what was it. I was like, I thought he was like, mm, Master Porn, no cheese. And I was like, what? <laughs> oh, yes. Um, well, only I would be able to have access to the Master Porn, no cheese, oh you know? God. Got any theories about the loops I'm trapped in? Why would I? Your name is literally Loop. Oh, stars above it is. <laughs> Ugh. But just because I call myself Loop doesn't mean I know anything. I'm just bad at names. But I'll see what I can do. What's your question? Do you know anything that could help? Such a broad question, Stardust. As I've told you before, I know as much as you do right now. How can that be? What do you mean? Aren't you here to help me? Why don't you know more about the loops you're supposed to help me with? <laughs> don't you teehee me! Is there something that happens when you talk to the head housemaiden that makes a certain goal impossible to accomplish? I get it. They want me to kiss Isabo. Uh, so how about you come back here early tomorrow after you're done acting things out at the clock tower? Wait, you want me to sneak out? And spend a loop with me, yes. But you always go to the house after the clock tower. If you're not here, what will everyone do? What will everyone think? Does it matter what they think? You'll forget all about it in your next loop, after all. Oh, I don't like this. Uh... I guess it doesn't. Neat! Will you come, then? <laughs> I'll come, yeah. Neat! I'll see you soon, then! Oh, why are you I guys, don't... I... Why are you guys freaking out? Are my vibes as rancid as my dogs now? <laughs> no, I, this, is, this is the first true time in this game. I'm like, no, 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 no! but you can't see Loop anywhere. Up there, Stardust, up there! Up there? Did Loop go back to their home or something? You look up. Loop is waving at you from the top of the tree. I'm here! I'm here! Come and join me, Stardust! How? Oh, come on. Just climb the tree. I know you can do it. You sigh and climb the tree. Pushes you. Ah! <laughs> It'll happen soon now. Hmm? What will? 
The theory crafting part of our hangout session, of course. You open your mouth to ask and then... Oh. Uh, you heard a horrible sound. Your head... You saw... Something. I'm glad you decided to spend some time with me, Stardust. Sorry it's going to end with this. What? I thought maybe it wouldn't happen, but... See that light in the distance? It's from the king's floor. I see it every time you get far enough to fight him. His first attack. The king's first attack? How long have you been talking to Loop? Who was the king attacking? Who was he? The king doesn't attack or do anything until you get to him. He would only attack if... If someone... I can feel it every time. Whatever he does, it makes you see something, doesn't it? Something awful. Something so terrible that it's enough to bring anyone close enough to their knees. Stars, I wonder who he attacked. You can't even hear Loop speak. Your friends. They were against the king just now. You know how to survive his first attack. You found out, but... 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 You hear someone cry out. You look at Loop. Loop is just... Looking at you. Not saying anything. No pity in their gaze. No sadness. Just some slight impatience. Like, did you figure it out yet? Did you figure out what made the king attack just now? There's only one answer, Stardust. Just figure it out already so we can move on. Who was the king fighting? Who did the king just kill? Did you figure it out yet? Did you? You start screaming. It's because you weren't there! They died because you weren't there! They're gone! Because you weren't there! You cut your head, your hair, your stomach! Because you weren't there! Because of you! They're gone! They're gone! Because of you! 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 You stumble and fall to your knees. You breathe harshly in and out. It's not working. You can't take a full breath. You can't. You hit the ground with your fist. Why? Are you mad? <laughs> Are you malding, Stardust? Are you malding? <laughs> Do you hate me? Would you kill me? Would you kiss me? <laughs> when Savvy showed me the Odile in Jordans and asked for feedback, oh. I screen capped her hand because he had it. I don't know if this was on purpose, but you had it in the paper pose. Like it's <laughs> it's it's paper, and yeah. uh, I, I I responded like, "Oh, you got it in the paper seal," and you were like, "Huh, yeah, would love to use scissors on her." What? Who said that? <laughs> <laughs> Why are you calling me out, Cello? <laughs> I thought it was funny. <laughs> <laughs> Tee call out. Oh. oh, young ones, are you? Here to kill me. Oh, oh, Alright. Yeah, 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 y
Just breathe. 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 Bonnie. Bonnie is... Okay. You're okay. <laughs> See, because of the way loops work, they, they won't remember anything. They're not hurt. Everything is back to normal. There's no reason the loops would work differently this time. Just breathe and stand up and make sure. Get back to the stage. Follow the script. You have to make sure Bonnie is okay. Bomb, 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 bomb. <laughs> ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. you're... Oh, change. You look... You look really, really tired. I thought you were taking a nap. Did you not sleep well? Not really. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. I'm sorry to hear that. I was going to tell you something, but forget about it. Uh, go, go on and do whatever you need to today. Sure. Do you know if Bonnie is okay? Bonnie? Why wouldn't they be? Oh, okay. I saw them near the fields earlier, to the east. Were you expecting Bonnie? Yeah, who's Bonnie. Bon That's what I. That's just the, ooh, dude, if whose Bonnie happened, I think I would have like literally just fucking collapsed off my chair. You know, Stardust, you're like really quiet, aren't you? I knew you were quiet, but I didn't realize you were that quiet. I really have to carry our conversations most of the time. Too bad. But I don't mind if you stay silent for a bit too. You know. <laughs> All right. Would you rather I don't say anything rather than talk all the time? Don't you want some quiet? Huh? What? No. I like to listen to people talk. I don't mind if you talk a lot. Yeah, that's it, isn't it? It is just nice to hear people talk. Like on a stream or something, Stardust. <laughs> like and subscribe. I know you've been through a lot, but it's September, and if you could subscribe to my Twitch channel, Stardust, it would mean the world to me. <laughs> you would get a bunch of cool dog emotes that are on my channel. And, you know, if you support me, it means we can do a lot more fun things on the channel, like loops and loops. Are you calling your party family members now? You know this sounds really awkward, right? You're awkward. Oh, you're cringe! <laughs> you're cringe! Oh, somehow this one seems to have hit home. Anyway, how can I help you on this? Oh, you're leaving. Okay. Great. Wow, bitch. I just came here to call you cringe. Goodbye. Am I <laughs> cringe? Oh my god. I'm legitimately gonna make a note to redraw the your cringe comic with that. <laughs> Where's this man from? Um, it's not specified. He's Irish. What? Oh, oh, oh. There it is. Hey, friend. Whoa, what's wrong? You catch your breath. Hey, Bonnie. Oh. Uh. Well, what do you want? Nothing. Hmm. See you at the clock tower. That fucking scared the shit out of me. <laughs> what the fuck? So then, if wishes can be that powerful, wouldn't anyone making a wish at any time be kind of dangerous? We'd be living in a very different world, wouldn't we? If someone wished to be the strongest person alive, or a kid wished for a million ponies? We can do that? Wish for a million ponies? Oh no! What did you all wish for? To the favor tree, you mean? Well, I mentioned it earlier, but I wished to win a coin flip. A wish that came true, now that I think about it. I'm just gonna... I wished for Seafrin to be stuck in time loops specifically, actually. <laughs> <laughs> it's like completely straightforward. <laughs> there's, there's no ambiguity at all. <laughs> <sighs> yeah, I'm kind of bummed I didn't wish for anything now. Why didn't I clap my hands and wish for something? Huh? Clap your hands. Uh, yeah. That's how you ask a favor to the favor trees. You look at the tree and clap your hands once and say aloud whatever you ask for. Uh, 
Um, Yusubo looks at everyone else. Is that not correct? No, that's what I did. Me too. This is how you taught me, Isabeau. That's also how I learned it at school? Seafreen, did you not do it like that? No, of course not. You make your wish and breathe it into the leaf you like best and fold the leaf over to keep your wish safe. What? It just makes sense. They're all looking at you. You've only wished it a favor tree that one time, but it, it just makes sense. You try to explain. You choose a leaf to, to represent yourself. Uh-huh. You breathe your wish into it to make a link between you and whatever you're wishing to. So, a link between you and the tree? No. The universe, I think? What's it? Keep going, Seafreen. You repeat your wish three times. Three times? Six could work, I think. Or seven, or thirteen. So, whatever number. And then you fold the wish into the leaf to tether the link between you and the wish. Touching it. They're all staring at you. If you just look at the tree and clap and say stuff aloud, why would, why would the wish know where to go? I suppose so. That kind of makes sense, I suppose. But that's so many details to remember. And that's not how we were taught at all. It's something we learn as Vogardians, and I've never heard anyone do it differently. But then, the favorite trees are more of a superstition, aren't they? No one really takes it seriously. Well, except lately, where everyone started taking it super seriously, just in case. So, so, so did everyone in the country mess up their wish? Ha! Huh. Odile starts laughing. Why are you laughing? <laughs> sorry, sorry, it's just funny. This could have been a way to save Vogard if everyone somehow wished for it. But no one knew how to do it correctly, so... <laughs> <laughs> And the only person who knew how to do it wished for... What did you wish for, Seafreen? It's embarrassing, so... I wish for Croissant to be eradicated. What? What? No! Not Croissant! And since Seafreen knew the ritual, Croissant might actually be... <laughs> oh, me. no. <laughs> <laughs> I sure hope this specific wish doesn't come true. Before I got made fun of for how I say croissant, I was going to tell you guys that because I couldn't have a pan au chocolat today, I got a crepe and I put chocolate and bananas in it. Um, but then everybody make fun of me for how I say French things. You say, I mean, you say French things as you should, to be honest. I'm oh, yeah. you're right. Crepe avec chocolat et banane. And it banana. was very good. Yeah, just banana. I was trying to think of the word for banana the entire time I was making it. I was like, what the fuck is it? And then I looked it up and it was like banana. And I was like, oh, well, shit. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, dude. It do be banana. It just banana. How about a how about a crack of my head on the pavement avec banana? <laughs> can, can we get some bananas in chat? Oh, they're already doing it. Oh, bless you, chat. Ah! Ah! Get some Yorvals. Oh my god! Two in the pink! Hey, <laughs> nothing else! <laughs> Just two in the pink! <laughs> I do one hand at a time! <laughs> wow, alright, this is happening at us, isn't it? <laughs> For once, I wasn't the one who initiated this! I haven't seen this enemy before! Our, our, bark, our. bark! Does someone want to see my dogs? Oh my god, we just skipped like 10 loops. No, we didn't. Yeah, I think we were at 66 nah. and we just jumped to 72. Nah, we were at like, we were at 108. We actually went backwards. We're doing great. <laughs> oh, thank god. <laughs> hey, a startup. Loop! I figured it out, Loop. Oh, the Everyone's music. Wish. It's probably the reason I'm here. Everyone's wish to save Vogard. Huh? It makes sense, Loop. I'm looping and, and not dying so we can beat the king. Everyone's been wishing for Vogard to be saved from the king. Someone in chat, happy face, honey. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, that, you're new here. That's not the vibe of this portrait. <laughs> Poor thief. My broken brain was just like, what if that was a random chance for Mario to be here with you? <laughs> <laughs> what the? Let's go. 
Who the fuck Seafried, is this guy? It's gonna be okay. <laughs> it's gonna be okay. Seafried. Seafried. Oh, my I made the wish that you never forget the Mario. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's Condoriano all over again. Oh, this is new. Seeing the king oh. right now after everything that happened, you can't help but look at his hands, and you remember. Oof. You're scared to fight. Oh no. <laughs> Yeah, we we didn't have access. It was public schools. We didn't have access to learning a second language until high school, and it was French, Spanish, and German. And I took the German class just because my sister had also learned. It. So I was like, okay, well, I can get some help uh, at home if by chance I'm I'm struggling. Uh, and that seems to have been the right choice because. I don't know. German German's a, a fun language. It's very like percussive. It's nice. Mm. And they have great names for the Pokemon, did you? I can I can't I can never talk about German without bringing up the German Pokemon names. They're so <laughs> funny. Let me tell you. Lickitung, all right. It's a great name. The Germans though? Schlup. 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 Great name. You've got Gloom. His name is Duflor in German. It's a great oh. name. Butterfree in German. Schmetball. Great name. I'm not familiar with that sport. German is a, a tough language to sound very gentle in, where like the the, the, the German I remember was like Du bist mein Schnuckelhaschen, which is like <laughs> really aggressive for you are my snuggle bunny. Schnuckelhaschen. Schnuckelation. It's like um, my French teacher used to call us uh, mon petit chou. And I was like, oh, that sounds really cute. And then she was like, yeah, it means my little cauliflowers. And I was like, what? <laughs> Are we your little cauliflowers? No, chat. Petit chou can also mean little cabbage, but it's like calling someone pumpkin. And then Dev says, kind of like how ma pousse is uh, also a pet name, but it means flea, little flea. Ma pousse? <laughs> <laughs> uh, my I, I, I am just repeating what I heard and what I heard. Not to be too controversial, but uh, my puss. <laughs> my puss. <laughs> Can't say anything to you, fucking people. <laughs> I couldn't help but over here. Pussy. See, friend, do you remember a few weeks ago? When I asked you if you liked being on this journey? You don't? Of course. Hmm. Back then you said... You said that being on this journey was the happiest you could remember being. Is that still the case, Seifrin? Are you still happy? <laughs> <laughs> I... I... I look... Everyone! I'm so glad we managed to win. Can you believe it? I think this calls for a group hug. Group hug. Pa pass. Of course you'll pass. You and friend never join group hugs. Zot, group hug, group hug. Group hug. Joe gets a point for a group hug. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> you watch Mirabelle, Isabeau, and Bonnie hug. Chat, I am going to eat my own leg. Doesn't seem to be able to meet your gaze oh. for some reason. What's up, you tall fuck? Can't meet my <laughs> traits either. You absolute monolith. Something's broken, something's failing, rotting. No, 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 she's repeating the same thing still. Why is she always repeating the same thing over and over and over? You just wish she would answer you. Now that you know, now that I know, you can fix it! <gasps> fix it? <gasps> no. Oh. It's too late, Seafree. Love the text box covering her eyes. It's always been too late. What? You can't move. You can't breathe. The wish is broken. She can't help you even now. You're stuck here forever. If only, if only we had fought back against the king instead. If only we didn't wish for such a thing. If only I knew this would happen. 
If I hadn't noticed it sooner, I would never have let people wish it all. To know you'll be trapped for all eternity, Seafrin. I am so sorry. It's our fault, all of Vogard, that you have to suffer like this. I just hope that one day... You might learn to forgive us. The curtain falls. You're back. You're back. <laughs> no, it's it's fine. It's fine. Uh, you had a theory, and it was wrong. You thought the head housemaiden would know how to save you, but she doesn't. That's all good. It's fine. It's all fine. At least you know why you're here. You're here because everyone wished for it. Everyone in Vogard wished for your suffering. Everyone wished for you to be stuck repeating everything to be rotting here forever. No, it's fine. It's fine. Uh, people in Vogard wished for the king to be defeated, for Vogard to be saved, but no one knew how to do wishcraft. No one knew the correct rituals. Is that why? Is that why you've been stuck in this loop? They wished for it, but wished wrong, and so the wish is breaking, folding in on itself because it was done wrong? Or maybe, maybe, uh, maybe you did it wrong. They wished for it, for the king to die, but, but he disappears every time you win, and the wish revolves around you, so maybe... And maybe you're doing something wrong every time, and, and that's why you're stuck here. That has to be why. If you're still looping after everything, after trying it all, then it must be that you're missing something. You must be going against the wish's will without realizing, and, and that's why it brings you back, because you're doing something wrong. You don't want to be here, so what... What are you doing wrong? Is it waking up? Are you waking up wrong or, or, or going to the house? Uh, but you have to, you have to go. You, you have to beat the king, save Vogard, because obviously saving Vogard is why you're here. Defeating the king is why you're here. And you do defeat him. You fight, you get his guard down. He talks, everyone talks. You attack all at once and you defeat the king with your own two hands. No, you don't defeat him with your own two hands. Mirabelle, she's always the one who deals the final strike, isn't she? You've never even once defeated him yourself. Is that why? It has to be why. But why do you specifically need to defeat the king? Why would everyone's wish revolve around... No, don't think about it. This, this is definitely it. This is it. If they all wish for you to defeat him and you're the only one stuck in this loop, then... Then, uh, then, then you need to do it yourself. Fight him and tear him to pieces and rip his hair out and reach into his chest and kill. It always comes back to him, doesn't it? It's his fault you're here. It's his fault you can't escape. It's his fault so many people are suffering. There you go. <laughs> That's a theory. That's a goal. You just need to make sure Mirabelle doesn't deal the final hit. That's all you need. That's all you blinding need, huh? Oh, but it's okay, right? It's fine, isn't it? Even if the entire country wished for you to be here, it's okay, isn't it? Because your family is here. You can stay with them forever. It's fine. As long as you're with them, you can live with this. As long as you're with them. You're fine. As long as you're with them. You're fine, aren't you? You're fine. You're fine. You're fine. But... But this thought is not enough for you to go on anymore. You want to be with your family. Not with those fictional characters that have taken their place. They can never change. They can never find out. They can never truly see you. They can only repeat the same lines over and over and over because that's all they can do. Because you won't even allow them to do otherwise if only Mirabelle didn't deal the final hit every time. If only she... If only... You knew if only the wish wasn't broken. It's auto-playing. Oh, if only the king dealt the final hit, the wish could come true and all the loops could kill you blindingly every time. You just need to kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him. You just... 
We need to get to the end. And win. And make sure everyone's wish comes true. You just need to... You just need to defeat the king on your own. You're fine. Get up, Seifrin. You have a country to save. Come to think of it, you forgot to tell her about the original shield skill earlier. The one you usually tell her about when you enter Dormont. Oh well. The shield she learns when you help her with her papers will do the job just fine, but you don't have time. You need to get to the king. You don't have time, you don't have time. Would you like some help with those papers? With my papers? No, of course not. Uh, don't worry about them. They're not important at all, they're... They're bonding papers, aren't they? Huh? How did you... Maybe I can help. I suppose I could use your help, Seafring. Yes, let's do it. It'll distract us both from our problems. You sit down. I'm going to the clock tower. I don't want to see you until tonight. But you didn't mean it like... You... You've made Mirabelle very upset. No, no, that's not what's important here, is it? And she'll get over it one way or loop or another, but, but you didn't get her shield skill. But maybe it doesn't matter that much. You could just bring her back to that book about shields in the secret library be before you go and fight the king. You don't really need her special skill after all. The usual shield skill will do just fine. It would be nice to get everyone else's special skill, though. Head back to it. No, something is wrong. What? Have you heard of something called a family tale? Huh? I may have. What about them? I've heard of someone who has one. Would you like to come check with me? Be Thank you for finding the family tale for me, Seafreen. I'm sure you have a lot of things left to do today. I'll be at the clock tower. Don't come back for a bit. Well, that's fine. You didn't really need that skill anyway. You can barely remember what it does half the time. And Odile already has so many useful skills. You'll be fine. You're the one who needs to deal the final strike anyway. You should talk to Bonnie next. It just puts me right here! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Fran? What's wrong? You look... You don't look good. I was thinking. How about I teach you how to fight today? R really? I... I... I'm... Um, I would really like that. Will you really? Of course. Oh! Then, yeah! Let's... I... I thought it would help. No! It didn't help! It really didn't help! I hate you, friend! I hate you! Bonnie cries and cries and cries. You can't move. I... I can't... Bonnie runs away. You, because of you, Bonnie, didn't get stronger. Not that their attacks got that much stronger after you talked to them, didn't it? You'll be fine, as long as you know Bonnie's here to watch your back. As long as you defeat the king yourself, it doesn't matter what skills they all do or don't have. One to go. Imagine if the Izubo conversation goes perfectly. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Isa. Oh, see! Your smile stops Isa in his tracks. This is not a good thing. Um, I... What's wrong? Um, nothing. Just... Miro, Deal, and Bonnie came to talk to me earlier. 
They all looked a little upset. So, uh... Did something happen? Talking behind your back, as always. Oh, no. Nothing happened, no. Would you like to go see the stars with me? The stars? But those only appear at night. It won't be nighttime for a few hours still. Later, then. Hey! What the... Seif, were you even listening to what I was saying? Seif. They were right, Seif! Something is wrong! Mirabel said you were acting weird since you woke up. Odile told me something happened with a book that you shouldn't have known about? And Bonnie was crying so much they could barely string their word two words together. Did you do something? Did they misunderstand? They had to, right? You wouldn't... You wouldn't do stuff like that. What's happening, Seif? Is something wrong? Can you tell me? Why is he so suspicious of you right now? Ah, so annoying, all of them. Always talking behind your back. Always acting weird, always deviating from their role every time you look away for a single blinding second. Don't they get it? You just want them to follow. You just want them to come with you. You just want them here. And the easiest way to keep them close is to make sure they don't die. And the easiest way to make sure they don't die is to make them stronger. Why can't they understand that? You don't want to talk. You don't want to think about your problems. You just want to follow the script, the universe, to the end, like always, except this time you'll break it, and you'll kill him, and you'll escape, and everything will be... Yeah, something's wrong. I knew it! What is it? Can I help? If you tell me, we can go and talk to everyone and... What's wrong is that you're getting on my nerves. Huh? Oh, Mr. Amazing, Wonderful, Funny Buff Isabo. Look at you. You're acting as if you're so calm and reasonable when all you are is weak and useless. Nothing to say this time. It's just fine. I know what kind of person you are now. What kind of person I am? A coward, Isa. Never able to say what you mean. Never able to do what you want. Because it's easier, isn't it? To not do anything. To only project a facade of confidence, but not doing anything to back it up. It's easier to let people do everything, isn't it? To just encourage them while staying on the sidelines. Poor Isabo. You keep changing and changing from a nerd to a jock to a clothing designer. But deep down, you know you can't escape yourself. I... I don't know where this is all coming from. But maybe you're right, Safe. Yeah, I'm weak. Yeah, I'm a coward. Yeah, I feel like I can never do things right. Yeah, I keep changing personalities like clothes because it's easier than learning to like myself. But at least I'm trying to change. I'm trying to be someone I can be proud of. I'm trying to be better. So I can help and support the people I care about, unlike someone else here. <sighs> I don't want to talk to you right now. I'm going to join everyone at the clock tower. I'll see you there. Oh, sure. Take your time, though. Take all the time you need. <sighs> it's fine. They're all upset right now, but they wouldn't go to the house without you. You just need to give them some time to calm down. Oof! And you have one last person to talk to anyway. Are you even sure you've never defeated the king yourself? Sure, it must have happened once or twice. You've been looping for a long time, so you might have forgot- It must have happened once or twice. I'm certain I never defeated him myself. And yet, how can you say it with certainty? 
Do you know something? No, I don't know any more than you, Stardust. It's just... I know that's not it. It has to be something else that's causing the loop. Something else that can break them. Something... Then what else, loop? What else am I supposed to do? What else am I supposed to try? Should I make everyone come with me? Should I rely on the power of love? Should I talk to the king? The head house maiden? Should I die? Should everyone die? What? What else is there? Haven't I done it all? There's nothing else, Loop. I know it's stupid. I know it's a long shot, but it has to be this. It has to be this, Loop, or, or... You fall to your knees. Or does it mean... It means... It means I'm stuck here for good. Aren't I? Forever? Loop. You knew. You knew this whole time. You knew this whole time there was no escape. Stardust. Stars. No, 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 Stardust, no. I... Why didn't you tell me? Why did you lie to me? I didn't. I was brought here to help you, and... And I thought if I was here, we could... You knew there was no way to break the loops. I thought that if we tried together, we'd... You knew! You knew! You knew! You knew! You knew! This entire time! Stardust! Did you have fun? Loop, was it entertaining? At least, was it funny? Did you like watching me run around in circles? Hoping? Wishing? Did you like the show? No. No, I didn't like to watch this at all. Curse you, Loop. Stardust, I... I'm sorry. I really am. But please, Stardust... Seafree! If we think, if we go through it all again, we can... You don't have time for this. After what just happened to all of us today, could you do it, everyone? Could you entrust your life and future to someone like Seafrin right now? You... You... decide to... It's a great idea, Seafrin. It's gonna work out so good, Seafrin. Are you Seafrin or Seafrout? <laughs> hey, Lenty, how you doing? Oh, I'm fine. Okay. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> oh. 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 Oh, Seafrin. Me. Oh. I would do that. <laughs> you would do that. <laughs> no, 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 wait, wait, wait. Dev, were you okay? Dev was just like, hey guys, thanks for asking. I am a good writer who can imagine things and then write them, but I appreciate it. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Seafrin. Safe. Where were you? You took so long to get here, we started eating our snacks without you. Come here, friend. I have some snacks for you to eat. Oh. You... You just need to defeat the king on your own. Your stomach hurts. You feel cold. Seafren, you might want to, like... You might want to get some stomach meds. Your stomach always hurts, man. He's got tummy hurty disease. Bro, you don't want to do this. <laughs> now I know what you're thinking. <laughs> But like, I'm feeling good. I'm thinking things are gonna change for me, huh? I, I didn't know him. Hmm, a mirror. You and your actors are reflected in it. That's 
That's a big mirror. Massive, even. And there's not really anything else of interest in this room. I don't know anything about it. Before the house got shifted around because of the king, it wasn't a part of the house. It was in a part of the house I didn't often walk by. Hmm. Isabeau is looking for the switch. If it is what I think it is, then it should be. Aha! Everyone, save from us. From that. What was that? Oh, look! Something's on the ground. A piece of paper. <laughs> Behold! Oh! It's the first one. It's a picture of all of you. It's us! This is lovely. Isn't it? It's a crafted mirror that takes pictures. I heard rumors someone was creating one, but I didn't know this someone lived in Dormont's house. We look so surprised. <laughs> Only Isabeau knew this was coming. Pictures are so rare. It's nice to have one of us. Thank you for telling us about it, and for taking a picture, Isabeau. Oh, <laughs> it's nothing. What should we do with it? Hmm. Odile looks at you. Would you keep it safe, O oh, one with all the secret pockets? You beam. Put the picture in your pocket along with your souvenirs. Uh-oh. Look at it. Oh. <laughs> you try not to think about them. Even if it was the same lines every time, it was nice, wasn't it? To listen to the same thing. It was restful, wasn't it? To know, to remember exactly what happens next. Is it worth it to try to break the loop by whatever means necessary? You like knowing what happens next. You don't have to think about anything. And even if you manage to break the loops, what will you come back to? Allies that hate you. Think about it, don't think about it, don't think about it. You keep going. I <laughs> Okay, see friend, let's, let's not to be hasty here. Alright. Ah! Oh, wait, we have another chance! You can still be a good person! <laughs> Memory of German poker app unlocked, you'll never forget this. God damn. <laughs> <laughs> I'm being fucking destroyed I mean we have time we have time to kill if you'd like to show off can you do the German poker rap as Seif and get go from like start of game Seif and get sadder and sadder <laughs> oh my God. you're uh um hold I need the lyrics <laughs> oh for some reason I assumed you knew it offhand I mean I do but I I um and you want to be sure well it's not like looking at it makes it any easier. I look at it and I'm like, mm-hmm, yeah, that's definitely right. <laughs> yes, that is German. I don't speak German. <laughs> Lamos. <laughs> Come on, Snapsy, come on, Snapsy, dear. Come on, Snapsy, dear. Their face, an intact statue of the changed god, stands before you. You wait. You try to sing the poker rap in German, but you get a headache. <laughs> 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 Speak it, bright one! <laughs> Say Come. the entire poke rap in our language and break the time loop. In fucking oh, yeah. tears. Kabuto snubilicat paras yabada rikala magi. Spewing from your mouth. Katabra uchikaria tito. Speak it, bright one. Rapi sandan pisa samglumanta tiwas. Pikachu! <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
<laughs> Holy shit. Watching Bonnie get crushed. Pikachu. <laughs> Pikachu. <laughs> It's real fucked up in here. You live like this? Barely. Hmm. Same. But how are we gonna survive the big attack? I'm just gonna fucking do it. <laughs> just gonna, I'll just fucking do it, okay? I don't have time for this. <laughs> just skip past it. Bright one. Your favorite Pokemon is Caesar. What's yours? Caesar, I'm told. It's Scyther. <laughs> Caesar, the sexiest Pokemon. What? No, it's Lucario. You're outing yourself, chatter. <laughs> Axe you 3127. What would Axe you think? <laughs> <laughs> Not the government name. Oh. A figure stands before you. Is it? What kind of Pokemon are you? How do you do the things you do? Share with me your secrets deep inside! Jigglypuff, your Jigglypuff, have... Jigglypuff. Your attacks have no effect. But all you can do is keep attacking. Hey! Don't just stand there silently judging me! Talk to me! Don't ignore me, say something! The figure opens its mouth and speaks. You stupid. <gasps> You're not slowed down anymore. You can move again. The king and everyone. Okay, I woke Seafin up. All right, nice job, Mira. Friend, are you okay? <laughs> you really think you can defeat me after everything? I have the power of the universe at my disposal. Your bright companion may have been able to hurt me because his craft also draws from it. But pathetic, wishless humans like you cannot hope to defeat me! The king? Whoa! Uh -oh. Everyone, get ready! Strikes. I won't let you! You really think I'll let you defeat us like this? After you froze my beloved house in time, my country, my home! I won't let you! We want to live! We want to be able to change, to grow! We don't want your eternity, King! But if you want eternity so bad, then take this! Uh. A sound like a sword getting deflected, like hitting a metal ball with a bat, like breaking a mirror. Did we do it? We did it! We did it! Crab, yeah! Crab, yeah! But you... <laughs> uh. How could you say all those horrible things to us, Seafrin? The head housemaiden should be up ahead, yes? Yes. Uh, we should get Seafrin to her. She might be able to help. And she might be able to tell us what's happening, too. I'll go on ahead and let her know. Let's go, Seaf. I don't trust like that. Why is he smaller? <laughs> Why is it small? Ogres aren't <laughs> supposed to be small. <laughs> Everyone! The head housemaiden is just ahead. 
I'm sure she'll be able to heal you, Seifrin. So just, uh, just come. Ready? You take a step forward. Oh, no. Whoa, Seif! Isabo caught you. Hey, hey! I got you, Seif. Always at your side. Oh, no. Oh, no deal. Bonnie's hat is huge. I'm worried. I hope everyone is okay. Wait, look here! It's Seafreen. Oh, 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 no. That's probably not good. Well, that's not good. <laughs> What's that shade? It's not dark or light or anything. It's just... We need to get to the head housemaid in as fast as possible. But looking it at can... it makes me feel, like, filled with dread. We should call it blue. Come on, see if I know something's up. You've been caught handed. Oh, look at it back there. Ooh. Ooh, I see you back there. Get away, mister. Do you want to hold hands, Fring? No, 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 it's fine. Yeah, you do. <laughs> Busted. Oh. Let's go, let's go. Oh, look at They're holding hands. Squad. Head hurts. So hungry. Okay, well, that's something at least. And what about the world outside? Oh, well, I... I don't know, but I could feel everything around us so strongly, and it feels... wrong. Every time I've tried to reach out and feel what's happening, I sense... chaos. It feels like something is... rotting. Huh? R rotting? I know you thought your quest was over, but it can't be. Something's broken, something... But I'm glad to see you all safe. Huh? Um, what? Traveling one. Traveling one. Traveling one. Are you done talking with your companions? Yes, wonderful, 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 wonderful. You Frazy, are you okay? Mirabelle, step back. She's repeating just like some of the rooms we went through. What's happening to the... Well, what's happening to the world? Is it happening to her, too? The same. Why, 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 why? You didn't beat the king on your own. You didn't fix anything. And they hate you, and you're still stuck here. You're still stuck here. But isn't it fine? Eternity is within your grasp. And you... You... You, Mirabelle's companion... Thank you for helping her get this far. You have my gratitude, and the entire country of Vogarts. Hey, Madame Head Housemaiden, can you hear us? She's scary. <laughs> Soon, you'll all be able to go back to your normal lives, away from battle and strife. Finally, you'll be able to go home. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah, sure. Home. Home. They'll go 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 home. No! Friend? Seafren, what's. They cannot go home! Seaf? Seafren? What's happening? Everyone be careful! Hmm. I won't let you go home. Oh, 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 no. oh. Huh? What's happening? Seafrin. What? Oh, no. Oh, no. No, no, no. Something went wrong. Why? You, Seifrin, 
Please, Stephen, listen to me. We can... So now you'll talk. Now you'll speak. When you couldn't say a thing before. It's too late. It's too late. It's always too late. Please wait. You push the head housemaiden away. Ah, you crazy. She's okay. She's okay. But, but we need to fight. Ah, it hurts. It hurts. It hurts. Oh, deal. Why are you attacking them? He's threatening us. I'm defending myself. Oh, no, no, stop! No! No attacking Frenny's our friend! We don't attack friends! But... Hurts, hurts, hurts. We don't attack friends. So if Odile is attacking you, it means you are never friends. It means you're hated. 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 It means you're hated! Can't hurt Don't. them. Attack the only person left. Seafrin, stop! Frin, why are you doing this? What's happening, Seaf? Talk to us! Seafrin! Just don't listen to her! I won't let you go home! I can't! I won't! I can't go back! And I don't want you to! Can't go back? I have nowhere to go back to, and you all do! I won't let you! I won't let you go! The king is beaten. That's what everyone wished for. And it's the end! The king is gone, and you're with me! He was right all along. I should have listened! After all this time, I have it. A perfect ending because we've won! And you're here! I won't let you go home, not now. I've gone through it all too many times. I won't go back, and I won't let you go now that you're here, now that we can be happy. Everyone going their separate ways. Everyone going home, this is not what I wished for. What? A perfect ending. Not what I wished for. Gone. Through it all. Too many times. Luke was correct then. Lindsay fucking making me cry. Yeah, straight up. Seafren! Oh. She keeps healing you. Seafren, the way you acted yesterday. The things you said. Maybe you did mean them. Maybe you didn't. Maybe it's a little bit of both. But beyond that, some of the things you knew. How you knew what Mira's papers were about. How you knew what Isabeau's dream to design clothes. How you fell in battle, like you knew it would push Bonnie to defeat the sadness. How you knew I was looking for a family tale. Something I hadn't told anyone. And immediately knew where to find it as well. How you managed to go through the entire house on your own? Even the way you were acting when we fought the king. And just now, how you said you've gone through it all too many times. Oh, huh? you two, you don't mean. Looks like that star was right, hmm? <laughs> yeah. Oh, I thought they were exaggerating, but see for you. You've been looping in time, haven't you? <sighs> no. If they find out, they'll hate you. If they find out you wished for this, they'll hate you. You have to loop back. You have to... You feel a tug on your stomach. Oh no, you don't. You won't be going back any farther, young one. You are staying right here until we are done talking! No, no, she can't. You can't let her do this! Whoa, that felt weird. Oh, the feeling. That was Timecraft, wasn't it? Seafren tried to rewind time just now, didn't they? I think you need to tell us your wish. Tell us your wish! It might be the key to freeing you 
The key to make sure, making sure you won't loop anymore. No. Tell us so we can help you. No. Tell us so you can be saved. No. Tell us already, you stupid crab. No, no, you don't want to. You don't want to think about it. You don't want to say it. You don't want to. Safe. See, friend. See, friend. This is what I wished for. I wish for Bogart to be saved. I wish for my sister to be okay. I wish to win a stupid coin flip. And I, and I wish that we'd be able to find you, to help you, to save you, Safe. And what about you, Safe? What did you wish for? What did you wish for? What did you wish for, Seifrin? Stop! It doesn't matter. It won't come true! You know this now! You've accepted it! You did! It doesn't matter! It doesn't matter! It doesn't matter! They can't make you tell them, please! 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 It will never come true anyway! Tell us! Tell us! Tell us! Just tell us, Seafrid! Just tell us Just what tell you us what you for. wished for! what you wished for. Come on. Tell us. 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 Just say it already. But... But I don't want to say it. Maybe we can kick your butt again to make you say it? Yeah. If we do, you'll say it eventually, right? We should try it out. Everyone, violence is not the answer! But I am in the mood for more butt kicking if you don't spit it out right now. Yes. <laughs> Against your will, a nervous laugh escapes you. Everyone grins your way. You laugh like a cat. Did you just say nya? <laughs> I. I wished I could just stay with everyone. What? Save. When we win against the king, then our journey ends, doesn't it? Mirabelle will go back to the house, Isabeau to Javon, Odile to Cabway, Bonnie to their sister. You'll all go back home. Hmm. Fryn. If we win, then you'll all leave. And I don't... I don't want that at all. I just want to stay with all of you. See, Fryn. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I know it's not fair. I know you have homes to go back to, and I should be fine with leaving, because you're fine with it too. It's fine that this journey meant more to me than to all of you. And that as soon as this journey is over, you'll forget me. But I didn't... I don't want to be alone. See, friend. And I didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to trap everyone here, but I... See, friend. Is that really what you thought? That we didn't care for you? That we'd forget all about you as soon as this journey was over? I don't want to forget the times we all had together. I wouldn't want to never talk to any of you again either. And nothing is keeping me in Dormont. I would love to leave, to keep traveling. And I've been thinking that for a while, but... But it's just wishful thinking, isn't it? I don't... I don't know if everyone... I wanna... I wanna see Neil again soon, but... But I wanna keep traveling too. I don't wanna leave everyone behind. I wanna make Malanga fritters for you, friend. And Deal still needs to teach me more Kabwan recipes. Bell needs to finish reading me that story I like. And I still have some pranks I wanna pull on Za. <laughs> no, not the pranks. But... <laughs> Yeah, I... It's the same for me. I have connections with all of you I've never had with anyone else. Even if it's just for a bit, I want to keep traveling with everyone. And after that, I want to keep in contact with everyone. I want to know who Bonnie grows up to be. I want to hear more about what Deal thinks of Ogardian culture. I want to see Mira open up and change even more. 
And I want to get to know you more, Sif. Talk to you more. Be with you more. I want to be with everyone for a long, long time. I... I never knew we all agreed on this. I thought I'd eventually manage to ask if some of you wanted to keep traveling for a bit. It would be nice to finally travel together without worrying about the king, after all, wouldn't it? But... I never found the courage to ask. And... I... I'm having fun. Traveling with you all. Talking with you all. I don't... I don't want to stop traveling with everyone just yet. Seafit! We want to stay with you too. It's not just you! This journey won't be over yet. Not if we have anything to say about it. And even when it ends, it won't be the end. We'll all stay in each other's lives for a long, long time. Yeah! So stop being stupid and thinking we'll forget you or whatever, because we won't, stupid friend. Seaf. Seaf, friend. Seaf, friend. Oh, no. No, baby. So, in the end, you love us so much, you wish to stay with us so hard, you almost broke the world? That's not great, friend. <laughs> <laughs> yes, see, friend. I had stalkers with less issues than you. <laughs> I think it's nice. I agree. Ending the world for love is what good stories are made of. I'm sorry. For everything. Which is? For saying all those things yesterday. Okay, good start. I think I'm speaking for everyone when I say that we forgive you, but we reserve the right to be mad about it still later. Oh, yeah. I won't be mad, but sure. I might be mad later when someone explains to me everything that happened with easy words. <laughs> you nod. It'd be fine even if they don't forgive you for a bit. And? And for, um, unknowingly trapping everyone in time. Oh, that one's fine, isn't it? Yeah, we don't remember that part, so no worries here. I also don't understand that part. <laughs> we'll explain everything later, Boniface. Thank you very much. And? Um, what else? I'm sorry. Apologize for, for not talking to us about everything, dummy. Yeah, dummy. We could have helped. Dummy! Even if I still really don't get it, the adults could have helped at least. We could have, if you would talk to us about it. About the loops, about how you feel, how you felt, about how you wanted to keep traveling together. Yes, you said horrible things yesterday, which made us all upset and angry. But then we learned you went to the house alone, and you went through it all on your own. And we learned that those horrible things you did, you did them all because you'd been going depressed and insane. Because you were repeating the same two days for a very long time. A time loop that started because you wanted to stay with us so much, you were subconsciously or not willing to trap yourself over it. Do you know how that makes us feel? Disgusted. Yeesh. <laughs> <laughs> I love Odile! <laughs> <laughs> I can't speak for everyone, but... Oh, but I think it's the cutest thing I've ever heard. Cute? See, friend, see, friend, see, friend. You love us so much you used some forgotten craft power to stay with us forever. That's cute. That's not cute, that's... Cute. No! Can't change my mind. You, you, you can't help but laugh. <laughs> that's not cute, that's... It's very cute. Okay. Now get out of here and go talk to everyone else. This emotional talk already tired me out. Not the battles or anything? Of course not, silly. I have a body in peak physical condition. Just, if you go... want to check it out, go follow Not Savvy for Work. <laughs> would, you, 
Would would you believe I got someone to do a pin-up of me once? <laughs> Go away now, see friend. Wait, what? Wait, strange... no, what? And I also feel bad about what happened. Huh? Why? I feel like since you were always so mysterious and cool, I didn't really try to know more about you. Because of the aura! The mystique! You look like you have secrets! Delicious secrets! And people probably ask you about them all the time, and I didn't want to bother you when it's not any of my business. So I never asked you anything about yourself or how you were feeling. But everything that happened to you made me realize you're someone who's actually very shy and introverted, like me. And you wouldn't tell anyone anything they didn't ask for, because why would you tell them something out of the blue, right? It's better to stay silent and not tell anyone anything about you or how you're feeling, right? Right. I don't want to bother anyone with my problems, so... So I'll keep my feelings here until I die! <laughs> you nod. I felt the same thing about the... About the king. About being the chosen. About having to save everyone. Everyone was counting on me, so I didn't want to bother them with my problems. But the problems still exist, even if you ignore them. Exactly. We're very similar in that way, aren't we? But what I'm getting at is you were dealing with so much in the last two days, and I didn't insist enough, and... <sighs> Look at your big pinchable cheek. So, Seafren, <laughs> during this journey we're about to start together, we should talk more. The two of us. About things! About how we feel! So we can help each other out. So we have someone to, um, hold us accountable on feelings, if that's okay. Maybe you'd like to talk to Isabo or Odile instead. I'd love that, Mira. Oh, <laughs> yay. Feelings buddies. Feelings buddies. You nod firmly at each other, then grin. Okay. I need to think about what we'll need to bring for this new journey. So go and talk to everyone. But you can talk to me later, too, if you want. I'm sorry for yesterday. Oh, okay. For what, though? For, um, being mean and trying to make you stronger and stuff and making you cry. Oh! Oh, no, it's okay. I get it. You were weird and mean yesterday because you were hungry and sick. What? I get it. I do. Me and my sister also get really cranky when we're hungry or sick. One time I broke her favorite bowl because I was hungry, and another time she yelled at me very loud because I didn't clean my room and she was sick. And you were hungry and sick at the same time. And also, um, you were sad, right? Because you thought we were all leaving? And because we, um, didn't notice you were sad before? Because we don't remember it? Because you went through the same day a bunch of times and we didn't know? Odile said... You were sticked in a time loops or something. I don't really get it, but isn't it like... It's like you had to go to school every day without taking a day off or even a lunch break, right? Like you had to sit at school and the teacher taught you the exact same thing every time? And you had to act like you didn't know the thing? And you had to do that for a very long time? Yeah, that's pretty much it. Whoa. But see, I've never been hungry and sick and sad and still had to go to school at the same time before, but I think that if I was, I would blow up the world. <laughs> That's how mean I would be. <laughs> you would blow up the world, huh? Blow up this whole crabbing world. And you were only mean to us, which is four people, but then you went through the whole house on your own, and you almost beat the king, too, and you almost blew up the world, I think, but not really, and it only made the sky go weird for a bit instead, so it's fine. I think that, uh, balances it out. Balances it out. Yeah, that! You laugh. Okay. <laughs> I still am sorry, you know. I tried to protect you, and I did the exact opposite. I shouldn't have done what I did. Hmm. It's okay, you were just being stupid. So I told me adults can be stupid, too. It happens. So try not to be stupid anymore. <laughs> I'll try, Bon Bon. Yay! Oh. <laughs> oh. Bonnie hugs you tightly. You hug them back. You have practice now, after all. Oh. All right, all right, let's do it. 
Hey, Seif. I'm sorry about everything I said. It wasn't cool, and you didn't deserve that when you were just trying to help. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, take a breath, buddy. You take a big breath. <laughs> yeah, Seif, and the stuff you said yesterday was so accurate and cutting, too. My poor little heart was so hurt. Your face falls. I was so hurt yesterday, I couldn't do anything except lie in bed crying. Mm. Think about what horrible spirit you had. And, hey, hey, stop making that face. I'm kidding. Sorry. Right. <laughs> <laughs> <Bye. laughs> Safe. I mean, yeah, you hurt my fifis. My linglings. <laughs> but it was also kind of cool. What? <laughs> what? I don't know. Sometimes someone reads you a little too well and it's like, oh, crap, that's so true. Why would you say this? Ow. But also, like, Oh, you pay that much attention to me. Mm -hmm. Oh. Mm -hmm. Your cheeks feel impossibly warm all of a sudden. And I'm guessing a lot of what you said was stuff we talked about before in your loops, right? And I must have repeated the same things a lot, but weirdly enough, I feel a little flattered. Thank you for seeing me this clearly. What the? You can't help but laugh. If you still feel bad, you can say something nice to me later balance things out. But I'm not mad about it. It was interesting. But also, don't do that stuff again. <laughs> you get a pass because you were sad and also going crazy. You nod. I'll be sure to only say nice things in the future. Yay! Then feel free to tell me all the stuff you want, and I'll do the same. Uh, actually, speaking of stuff to tell, can I tell you something, maybe? You try not to inhale sharply. If that's okay. I just have something to tell you, and I feel like this is the moment. You nod. Oh, crap. Okay, well, um... <clears throat> I don't know, Seif. Are you sure? Is it okay if I tell you something now? Because it might be a lot, and you've been through a lot today already, and I just want to make sure you'd be fine if I told you, and... <laughs> How interesting. Even now his hand is reaching out to you, hovering, unable to take the first step. Gently, you take his hand and hold it tightly. Mm. He inhales sharply. The universe seems to hold its breath. I shouldn't wait, right? I should just go for it, right? And tell you? I love just... Dev going, let's go, let's go, let's go, as though it's not your fault it takes this. <laughs> <laughs> you just look into his eyes and wait. Okay. Oh, okay, then. Mm. Seif? Seif? I really, really like traveling with you during this journey. I really care about you. You're one of my best friends, my comedy partner, an incredibly important person to me, and, and I... And I love you, Seif! I love you so, so, so much! I love talking to you, and hearing your jokes, and seeing the little smirk you make right before telling one, and, and how you're so nice, and how you always listen to what everyone has to say, how you always try to give advice even though you're not always very good at it. Oh, and I love your eye! Your hair looks so soft, and I love that you're small and cute, but I like in the way very sharp cooking knife with flowers and little hearts is small and cute. And I like how your face looks when you eat something you like. And how you hide your face under your hat when you feel embarrassed. And how you like, or, and how you look all focused when you watch a play or read a book and... Oh, stars. You feel lightheaded. You sway a little. Oh, sorry. I got a little excited. Oh, man. <clears throat> it felt like I couldn't stop talking. Like I was sitting on this forever. Did you hear all this already? Did I just repeat myself like an idiot when I already confessed a bunch of times? So it's... No, that was the first time. What? Weird! And cool! Oh, well. Now you know. <laughs> I love you, Seif. I love you. You better not forget it. I won't, Isa. Thank you for telling me. And I love you too, Isa. Oh, whoa! 
crap, yeah! Well, uh, to be honest, I knew you did because I have eyes. <laughs> <laughs> but do you love me the same way I love you, though? Give me some time to figure it out. Of course! Take all the time you need, Seif. <sighs> Your face feels warm. He can't stop smiling. Oh, oh look at him! <laughs> I don't like to show off. Being too smart puts people off, I think. I mean, look at Madame Odile. What? <laughs> what? Are you trying to tell me something, Isabeau? We like you for your stunning personality and not because you're smart, madame. I need you to know that. Ha! <laughs> well, same to you, Isabeau. Aw, that's... And we wouldn't like you any less if you were smart, you know. Oh. Sounds fake, but okay. You finished talking to everyone, so... This is it, isn't it? The end of your journey once more. It's all over when you talk to her. For the final time. Traveling one. Are you worried? Worried? About what? About looping back? The fuck. I'd always loop back whenever I'd talk to you. You would talk and then the loop would... Whenever we'd talk? But why? Maybe because... Because talking to you... means our journey to save Vogard is really over, isn't it? And for you, Seafrin, it also meant that all of us going our separate ways, doesn't it? The very thing the loops were trying to stop. Oh, so you think you might still go back? No. You won't. You're too exhausted, too weak. But but what if... Hmm. Nah, won't happen. So quick! <laughs> but how do you know? What? Don't you trust me? Dev voice. Don't you trust me? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dabs cutely. You'll be fine. <laughs> You'll stay right here with us. Because we'll stay together for a while longer now, friend. We'll still be together for a while. And after that, we'll still be together, even if we're not. Plus, I doubt there's any craft left for you to use. You really burned yourself out earlier. My bet is that your little temper tantrum earlier used up all that energy from your wish. You might still be able to use some crafts now, although I wouldn't recommend it for a bit. But I doubt you have any energy left for time craft. You won't move back. I'll super duper promise if you want. You laugh. Yes, you know it's over. There's nothing to tell you otherwise, but... We could, um... We could hold hands. Hold hands? Hold hands! Hold hands. If Rin is worried, I don't know. Just an idea. Um, that way, even if you do go back, we'll go back with you, right? That sounds right to me, yes. <laughs> Ugh. Fine. Let's hold hands, then. Odile takes Bonnie's hand. Head housemaiden? Oh, yes, of course. The head housemaiden puts her hand in Odile's and takes Mirabelle's also. <laughs> Isabeau. <laughs> yes! Mirabelle and Isabeau happily link hands. Friend, friend. Mm. Come on, friend. Bonnie's sticky hand grabs yours. Safe. It has pineapple juice on it from her pockets. You die. Dies. <laughs> but... Shyly, you put your hand in Isabeau's. You feel warm. Mira's so cute in the sea. Yeah. Yeah. Little bean. Um. What now? Well, if it ended every time you talked to the housemaiden, Seif, then maybe tell us a story, Madame Head Ma Housemaiden. Oh, what kind of story should I tell? A funny one. A cute one? A nice one. What about Belle? Huh? <laughs> well, everyone, let me tell you about the very first time Mirabelle made a classroom explode. No! Yes! <laughs> <laughs> you close your eye. The head housemaiden's words wash over you. 
your head doesn't hurt. Your stomach is full. You feel Bonnie and Isabeau gripping your hands tightly. You feel the wind caress your hair. You feel nothing but the world around you. You inhale. It smells like fresh air and leaves on a sunny day. You smile. Whoa! Oh, man. Oh, wow, $20? That's enough to buy in Stars and Times. Dan McNeely! Let's go! No! Bet you weren't expecting to see me in this game, huh, baby doll? <laughs> that... <laughs> that was incredible. Oh. There's a little more. Why are you still here? What do you want me to say? What else is there to say? You've won! <laughs> oh, Stardust. Let's just get right to it. Final boss! <laughs> oh, oh, fuck. Not what I was expecting. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Here's a tutorial for you. If I die, I can loop back. What? Surprised you're not the only one who can loop back? <laughs> Have you forgotten? Have you forgotten who I used to be? It's okay. I know you forget literally everything. That's just the kind of person you are. Keep fighting, keep fighting. Stage, lights, Action! <laughs> you know, in a way, I am so very proud of you. You did so good, Stardust. I'm so proud, Stardust. The universe brought you to victory. Uh, it only had to lead and you followed. And I suppose what the universe wanted from me was to just shut up and take it. Everyone's favorite cosmic joke. <laughs> yeah, yeah. From main character, to stage director, to sponsor, to corpse. The king. I could never beat him. Did you know that? No matter how hard I tried, the king always defeated me. And yet, look how easily you beat him your first time. Oh, you may think it was easy, but just seeing you succeed. I was so blindingly angry! Why did you manage to beat him this easily? What kept me from defeating him? What script was I following that kept me from victory? Is that what the universe wanted from me? The universe, the stars, the king, our country. I hate them all! I hate them! They can all die! I love that Seifern just says nothing. This <laughs> often say. Yeah. Uh, it'd be incredible if Seifern just like took an air, like AirPod out and like, huh? Oh, oh. Uh oh. And the curtains open once more. I finally saw your party earlier. I did really well this whole time. Made sure they never saw me. Made sure I never saw them. Those pale copies of the party I knew. I didn't want to see them ever again. Didn't want to know. <laughs> Can you believe? I forgot their names for a time. Despair and trauma does that to you sometimes, doesn't it? But I had to talk to them, didn't I? I was ready to tell them everything. Tell them who I was, what happened to me, that they had to go after you. And yet, and yet when they saw me, it was like they were looking at a stranger. Can you imagine how it feels, Stardust? I'm so happy all of you guys jumped on this playthrough, by the way. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh.
Goo. Goo. Damn, Luke. Maybe we both need to go to therapy. No. I'm oh. normal. <laughs> All right, have a nice day. No. <laughs> I loved them. I loved them. I loved them. And yet they didn't recognize me. Didn't remember me. Because it never happened to me, did it? It happened to you. You're the one who got their perfect ending. It's remembering the times I spent with them when they can't remember me. This is worse. This is worse than forgetting. I wish I could forget Stardust. Oh, Stardust, do you know how this feels? Can you imagine it? Do you know how it feels to know some copy of you won and you're left with nothing? Mirabelle, Isabeau, Deal, Bonnie. They were mine, they were mine, they were mine! They were mine first, and you stole them from me! You stole fizzy lifting, lifting drinks! drinks. <laughs> <laughs> you lose, Stardust! Stardust. <laughs> Have him sent to the penis exploder and have his penis exploded immediately! Time for your dick flattening, Stardust! <laughs> <sighs> Loop flinched. Seeing the opening, you strike. You wink and attack. Loop can't fight anymore. You've won. Seafrin, Stardust, whatever our real name actually is. Just kill me. Okay. Une main sur une épaule, chacun a bien joué son rôle. Le rideau 